I want to just bring a very, very simple word of encouragement to our hearts this morning. Nothing complicated, very simple message. Weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. And that is true for all of us. And that's the word I just want to bring to our hearts this morning. No matter what situation you find yourself in, there is a God in heaven who can turn things around in your life. No matter what your situation is, He brought me out of a horrible pit. I don't know what your horrible pit is. I don't know what that Murray Clay for you would mean this morning, but there is a God in heaven who brings us out of the horrible pit, who lifts us out of the miry clay, and he puts our feet on solid ground. And not only that, he's given me a new song to sing. He gives us a new song to sing, something new that we can talk about, something new that we can sing about, something new that we can give thanks to God for. And he says, many will see it. I just want to remind us this morning, there is a God in heaven who does such wonderful things in the lives of people who look to him, who wait patiently. You see, God doesn't have all of us on the same schedule. So don't look at your neighbor. God has a timetable for each of our lives. It's very unique to us. But in his timetable, he's got a way for you out of that horrible pit. He's got a way for you out of that Marie clay. I want to let you know that the God of the Bible is still here today. He's waiting to do that for you. He's done it in the lives of many people who are seated. They've gone through it. I've gone through it. I've seen God turn things around in my life. And I believe and I can say with all confidence, along with many other people in this room, God is ready, God is able, and He will do the same in your life. He's the God of a turnaround. He's the God who turns our mourning into dancing. He's the God who causes us to forget the pain. He's the God who causes us to be fruitful in the same place, in the land of our affliction. He can turn things around. God has your good in mind. The end intended by the Lord is always good. Today, I want to declare over our lives that there will be a lifting up out of the horrible pit, out of the miry clay, that God will put you on solid ground. He'll establish your steps. That he'll give you a new song to sing. That people will see and put their trust in God. I want to declare it over you today that by the power of the Holy Spirit, that God will give you beauty for ashes. He will give joy for mourning, praise for heaviness, double honor instead of shame, rejoicing for your confusion, fruitfulness in place of all the hardships, labor and toil, and double measure for all that you've lost. And God, by His Spirit, will do it. It's enough for you and me to stand on that word and say, God, here I am today. I am believing for a turnaround in my life. I'm believing, God, that you turn my morning into dancing. I'm believing that you will pick me up out of the horrible pit and put my feet on solid ground. Whatever that means to you. It may mean different things. It will mean different things for each one of us. Whatever your life situation is, believe for a turnaround. Believe for a lifting up. Believe for a change in season. Believe that God will do in your life what he did in the life of Joseph, what he did in the life of David, what he did in the life of Job, whatever he did in the lives of people in the Bible and the lives of others sitting here, that God will do the same thing for you this morning.